God's peace be with you. Welcome to our devotional for Wednesday, December 22nd. Today's devotional is based on Paul's letter to the Romans, chapter 16, verses 25 to 27. Now to God, who is able to strengthen you according to my gospel and, and the proclamation of Jesus Christ, according to the revelation of the mystery that was kept secret for long ages, but is now disclosed, and through the prophetic writings is made known to all the Gentiles, according to the command of the eternal God, to bring about the obedience of faith to all, the only wise God through Jesus Christ, to whom be go glory forever. Amen. So today's devotional from Daily Feast was written by Sally Brown. God continues to be astonishingly inclusive. And we have learned to read and reread our Bible in light of the evidence of God's Spirit breaking out in the lives we assumed were not qualified. God's goal is unchanging, that all should join in the obedience of faith, that all should experience a being redeemed way of life. And we're left with this to ponder. If you had to sum up your expression of gratitude for the wonder of the Incarnation in one word, what would that word be? Let us pray. I am shocked beyond words with the thought of your magnificent love. Amen. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord's face shine on you with grace and with mercy. May the Lord look upon you with favor and give you peace. Amen. Thank you for joining me for today's devotional, and I hope you find these moments meaningful. Until next time, whenever that may be, I pray that you remain safe and healthy, that you're practicing social distancing, that during this wave of the pandemic you're washing your hands frequently, and that when you're out in public, you're wearing a mask. God bless.